Hey, this is Dan Seifert with MobileBurn.com, and here we are at CTIA 2012, taking a look at one of Kyocera's new devices that has just been announced. This is the new Hydro smartphone. It's an Android 4.0 ice cream sandwich device, but its real claim to fame here is the fact that it's a waterproof model. It features uh, certification for both IPX5 and IPX7 waterproof ratings, so that means you can splash it with water, you can take it out in the rain, and you can even submerse it in up to a meter of water for 30 minutes at a time. Otherwise, we're looking at a pretty standard entry-level Android uh, 4.0 ice cream sandwich device. As far as specs, we've got a 3.5-inch HVGA capacitive touchscreen. It is an IPS model, so you do get very good viewing angles, as you can see here. Below that, there are four capacitive buttons that Kyocera has installed for back, home, multitasking, and menu. So despite the fact that this is an Android 4.0 phone, we do have capacitive buttons at the bottom. Uh, around back, there's a 3.2 megapixel uh, camera with LED flash, and that does record video as well. And you can see here we've got a nice grippy texture on the back of the phone, so it helps in aid in your uh, handling while you're holding it. And then there's a lock on the battery door uh, to uh, produce the uh, or enable it to be waterproof. Underneath the cover is a 1500 milliamp hour battery. Oh, we got a little Angry Birds space starting there. Uh, and then there's uh, the, again, a 1500 milliamp hour battery. Now this is a CDMA device. It will be coming to CDMA carriers in the US later this year, but Kyocera has not announced which ones just yet. Uh, and, you know, it's really not that bad. It's going to give a nice uh, entry-level option for customers who are really concerned about dropping their phone in the sink or in the toilet or other uh, wet areas. So there you go. That's a real quick look at the new Kyocera Hydro from uh, here at CTIA 2012. This is Dan Seifer for MobileBurn.com. Thanks for watching.